welcome to Prendergast Lady Wolf School. I want to talk to you today about our second PSHE day. This year we've been really keen to link the PSHE program with the core work we've been doing with the Student Council around our program of PLS CARES. CARES is an acronym. Community, Ambition, Resilience, Effort and Success. The core values that we want to develop in all of the young people here at Prendergast Lady Wolf School. This year, Year 7 did some work with an organisation called Youth First that partnered with the Mayor of Lewisham and they focused on the community and spoke to young people about being part of this community here at Prendergast Lady Wolf School in Lewisham. Year 8 had a number of workshops around resilience and developing those core skills to ensure that young people can overcome challenges academically and socially so they can be successful. Year 9 was focused on effort and success. There was a Creative Minds project throughout the course of the day where young people thought their way through a various number of challenges and issues. Year 10 had a really important career session. It's just in advance of their work experience. They had mock interviews with professionals from across London. Um, they spoke to them about how to present themselves in interview situations and a number of them were hired for the job um, in a celebration assembly at the end of the day. In year 11, they're at the sharp end, it's about their examinations and they had a day again focused on resilience and on exam preparation. PSHE day has become a core part of the offer here at Prendergast Lady World School and we make sure that young people are prepared for life in school and also beyond school. I hope you've enjoyed looking at clips today about our PSHE Day 2 here at Prendergast Lady World School. We understand the importance of equipping young people with the skills and attributes they will need to make the right choices for their futures. Hello, my name is David McLaughlin and I'm the Assistant Head Teacher in charge of Key Stage 3 at Prendergast Lady World School and I'm here today to tell you about our second PSHE Day of the academic year and the offer for our students in Year 7, 8 and 9. Each year group focused on a particular strand of the CARES ethos. Year 7 focused on the CARES strand of community. Their sessions were led by a group called Youth First and the workshops focused on a range of issues related to staying safe in the community, such as the threat of knife crime, healthy relationships and online safety. Year 8 focused on the CARES strand of resilience. They had an art workshop in which they reflected upon times in their lives when they needed to be resilient. Students also had a presentation on the dangers of eating disorders and worked with a group called XLP on how they can overcome challenges to achieve their future goals. Year 9 focused on two strands of the CARES ethos, effort and success. They had sessions led by an organisation called Creative Minds who led sessions on future aspirations and how they need to change or adapt to reach their future goals. This was another excellent day for our Key Stage 3 students, helping them to reflect upon and put into practice the CARES ethos at Prendergast Ladywell School. Thank you very much for listening and I look forward to speaking to you again about our next PSHE day. Welcome to Brendergast Ladywell School and our second PSHE day. I'm Alison Harbottle, Deputy Head Teacher and in charge of Key Stage 4, which means that I oversee Years 10 and Year 11. On this PSHE day, we looked at ambition and resilience, two of our core values for both Year 10 and Year 11. Year 10 had an excellent day run by ER Events. Their focus was particularly ambition. And in doing this, they focused on CVs, applications and mock interviews to prepare them for their future careers. The first couple of hours were spent with tutors, looking at different CVs and application and practicing these for real life jobs. Then the next section of the day was with external people who came in from real companies to interview the students. So the students were allowed to come in office dress and prepare themselves suitably for a real interview. These were conducted in formal situations and then at the end of the day, a selection of students were officially hired for these jobs and given prizes for their excellent conduct. The day really prepared students 
for their futures and thinking about how they present themselves and how they prepare themselves for their future career choices. For Year 11, we really wanted to link the day with what they have to do for the next four months as they prepare for their GCSEs. And so in doing this, we really looked at resilience and how this links into achieving their ambitions. So for the first section of the day, we had a carousel of activities on a range of different resilience activities. These included looking at the civil service, work with Metropolitan Police on decisions and consequences, and sex and relationship education. The last session of the day was spent back with tutors, where students looked at their post-16 applications and prepared themselves for interviews going forward, whether that be for college, later on in university, or their careers. It also gave them a chance to reflect with their tutors about how they'd found the day and the different speakers and information that they'd had. Overall, we were really pleased with the Key Stage 4 PSHE day. All the students were fully engaged, we had excellent reviews from the external people that came in and it was a very useful day for everyone. My name is Ava Tambala and I'm a Year 10 student. For our PSHE day, we focused on employability. This was to prepare us for our work experience which will take place from late February to early March. We started the day by preparing for our mock interviews with our tutors. We were taught how to approach the questions in our interview and how to apply for jobs in the near future. During my interview, I was quite nervous. However, when I actually went into the interview and started answering the questions, I found it was easier. One of my favorite aspects of the day was when we went to assembly at period five and we played this interactive game where we picked which CV layout was the best. And I felt like that was quite educational for me and that would help me in the future. Okay, my name's Deborah. I'm your deputy head girl and I'm in year 11. And on Friday we had PSHE day and there were a lot of sessions for us. The first one was about um, policy and working in the civil service. And for me, it was really interesting because I had my work experience there. So I knew some of the faces and I knew what it was about already, but it was interesting to see what other people thought about it. We also had another session on sex relationships and consent. And we had lots of questionnaires and it was exciting to see people actually find out like different topics and different different informations and stuff like that. And then we also had our elective sessions and I chose graphic design. And we had someone who did, who's um, the co-founder of a company who does British anime. And it was really cool to see how he got there and the fact that he had no background to do with it at all. And it was interesting to see what different career paths you could potentially take in the future.